Good morning, geeks. Welcome back to our channel. Today's Thursday. Wednesday. <laughs> Today's Wednesday. Anyhow, um, it is 9 in the morning. I actually got to sleep until 8.30. And last night, I stayed up late packing up the room because I'm moving out of the room. Yay! <laughs> I'm moving to the condo. So although I have a couple nights here, I'm actually going to go stay at the condo tonight for the first time because I have the movers coming to move the furniture from the garage into the condo. It is quite a feat for myself to do. So I actually asked for help, made a donation, and voila, got it. So they're meeting me at the condo at 1 o'clock. So I want to get out to the condo before they do so I can open up everything and so I can get to the super Walmart down the street and pick up some things like shower curtain, so I need to take a shower, and a blanket, because there is none. <laughs> and of course, I have detergent such that was um, sent from Instacart to the condo last week. So, or this past Saturday. Yeah, it was this past Saturday. Anyhow, um, so I'm gonna go there and wash my clothes as well because I do have a week's worth of laundry that I accumulated. And I was excited when I saw the washer and dryer in the condo that I wanted to make sure I go there and wash my clothes. So I got detergent. So I have everything packed up. I am just going to call an Uber and get out there because I need to get out there already. And I will see you all there. In my refrigerator, this is actually all from the strawberries that came down. But in my refrigerator, I have this and this that I'm leaving. I would take it with me. But I really have a lot to carry already. So I'll just leave this for housekeeping. They can have it. And here, remember my desk area where I had all the stuff and my computer and everything? I am actually all packed up. And on my bed right here where I had these, this big thing open and everything laid out, that is all packed up as well. <laughs> and... Here, I had all my clothes hanging. That's all packed up as well, too. I am packed up and ready to go. I'll miss it here. The service was really good. Nobody bothered me, which I actually liked. And um, the bed was comfortable. There's a lot of things that I'll miss being here. I think it was a close proximity to work. But even though I lived about a mile and a half away, it kind of felt a long, long way. So... Um, I look forward to my friends coming to visit me on Saturday and I'll keep that a secret till you guys see who it is. Uh, I need the company. I really do. It does. It really does get lonely being out here by yourself, especially when I'm really, really, really missing the kids. You know, I miss them so much. I was able to FaceTime with them last night. Uh, my sister Kahia and my mom had them over the house for the evening and so I was able to FaceTime and the baby of course I made him laugh and he he understands and I saw him a little bit irritated that I'm on the other side of the phone and not by him <laughs> and I can read him really well on me because I am his mom but I know he was a little bit irritated where have you been mom how come you're on the other side of the phone and you're not here by me so I had to tell him you want to go bye bye you want to go on an airplane come see mama and he realized that he realized that mom is on an airplane mom is away and it'll be about 17 days or so before I see them which you know I'm just gonna keep myself busy with what I can today I am also getting a new coffee table and end tables and a TV stand all delivered and they're all matching and I got that on Facebook for cheap and I'm also getting a dining table delivered as well for cheap so I'm very, very, very happy that I have a full dining table and coffee table and two end tables and a TV stand for the TV. So at least we'll have that ready to go. And all I'm looking for now is a bed for my room because I have the two double beds to go uh, in the two rooms. And then I have a couch. I need a bigger couch because it's a two-seater love seat and it pulls out to a bed. So as soon as I get a bigger couch, I might put that love seat in my room. So that way I have that extra 
um, couch slash bed so when people come and visit they can actually use the extra bedroom and sleep in Kate Will's room and Kate Will can sleep in our room on the pull-out couch so I think that will make sense and I will show you everything as soon as it's all set up but we're gonna head out to the well we're me and my personalities are gonna head out to the condo right now and we'll see you when we get there all right geeks <laughs> I am actually in the condo right now checked out of the hotel fully moved out here now i'm waiting for the movers to come because they're going to bring the two beds up for the two boys rooms and the couch and the tv i have the tv being hooked up the tv the tv i'm having the tv hooked up <laughs> actually i got the tv hooked up tomorrow they come to hook up the gas and I'm going to have some, I have a delivery from Walmart, which is going to bring items like um, a shower curtain, soap, um, blankets, pillows, stuff I don't have here. That's what Walmart is going to be bringing to the, I'm so thankful for this delivery service. Oh my goodness, it's the best thing that ever happened to the world, seriously. Anyhow, so all that's coming this afternoon. And so when we do finish moving everything in from one to four, I'll go down to a local shop over here where they sell beds. And I'm going to look for a king size bed for my room. And hopefully they can get that delivered tomorrow. So that way I have a king size bed coming. And yeah, so we got a lot of stuff going on today and a lot of stuff going on tomorrow, which is good because I have two days off in a row that gives me time to put everything together. And then after I get the furniture and stuff situated in here, then I can definitely work on putting all the little details before the kids come. And my husband comes too. <laughs> so right now it's almost one o'clock. So the movers will be here. And when they do come, we'll take a sneak peek at what they do. So a lot has been going on today and I was not able to film the movers moving the things into the house but we were able to get a lot of things in here and I'm so thankful to the church for sending some people over to help me bring in everything for the movers. I wanted to show you the Kit Kit was bed. Nice bed. Super nice bed and guess what? It lifts up so this part comes up. I'll let him show that to you when he gets here. And then we have another bed in the other room. In, 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 we do have a two-seater pull-out couch. This is perfect for us. And then the TV here, which I'm trying to put together. And I'm getting two nightstands, a coffee table, and a TV stand coming tonight as well. And then I'll put the TV together with the cable box. And tonight I'm also getting a dining table, which I'll probably be putting that together when it arrives. And, 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 and what's coming is something in here as well. So once all of that comes, then I will show you a full tour of everything that's here. Of course, it's not fully decorated, but it is in motion and it has been a very busy day. We had the movers here. We had the cable hooked up. We have the internet hooked up. The gas guy comes tomorrow to turn on the gas. The, um, look, artwork. Beautiful artwork that came as well. <laughs> and we have two deliveries from Costco, trying to fill up the pantry with food for the kids before they get here. And we have dishes that I need to go and clean and clear. See, dishes over here, coffee maker. So I need to get that all cleaned up, put away. Artwork needs to be hung, and shower curtains need to be hung, and the two beds need to get their linen put on. So there's so much things to do. Gonna be quite busy tomorrow, 
but so far everything is headed in the right direction and I am so thankful so thankful to have the two days off in a row so thankful that everything is coming into place as it as I hoped it would be and then I also have my Walmart delivery coming that's the best thing about living here in the mainland you can get things delivered so I got two Costco hauls delivered already food for my kids when they get here and then Walmart I got stuff coming with Walmart too but stay tuned I am going to show you the table once it's done and the bed once it gets here then hopefully we'll be a little bit settled and ready to go okay what the actual hell am I doing oh my gosh this is crazy it is about 7 30 at night and the table set just came in just came in and 10 minutes before he came the coffee table and the TV stand with the two nightstands came in so just getting a whole bunch of stuff delivered today getting it out done finish getting it all done so I can spend some of my time sleeping because I need some sleep <laughs> or eating I haven't eaten yet so this is it so far now I'm gonna put that table together I just put a desk together a desk and two desk chairs now I'm putting this table together this moving deal is horrible I ain't doing it again for a very very long time good morning geeks it is the next day it's about 8 30 and I was woken up by the gas guy who came in to check on our gas lines and turn on our gas I am in the closet as you can see I haven't barely even filled it with stuff and of course Nevin's jacket <laughs> I had a good night. I had a good first night in the condo. Hardly slept. I guess it's because one, this room is huge, or I just gotta get acclimated to sleeping somewhere else other than who I used to sleep. <laughs> when I was staying at the hotel, it was the same thing. First two nights, I was restless. But it was quite nice to sleep in my own bed. Nice bed. I was so thankful, thankful because we had, or I had help bringing a lot of this stuff up to the apartment. I bought a lot of these things off of uh, Facebook Marketplace, which here in Utah is amazing, super amazing. The two end tables here and the coffee table and the TV stand I bought from one person. They helped me, the husband and wife delivered it to me, and they helped me carry it up the stairs to the apartment and this king bed I bought from an elderly couple and the downstairs the guys downstairs I have some young roommates right below me they helped me carry the entire bed up here to the apartment so I had help and let me tell you it's eight steps six flights coming up to the apartment no elevator but you know what it's done moving day is done my body is sore but can't stop right gotta keep going so i'm heading off to super walmart right now to pick up a few doodads i need a hdmi cable for the tv a router um and some other small stuff a curtain rod those little rings to hang the shower curtain so i have a lot of things that i need to go and get all righty roof skype the gas guy came and hooked up the gas. I could have done it myself. No, actually, no. I, I'm not going to do it myself. But guess what? We got hot water now. La, 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 la. I'm actually liking that. Last night, I had to take a cold shower. It wasn't happening because it was freezing. I actually figured out how to do the dial to keep the temperature between a certain point in the condo. <laughs> this high tech stuff is just over my head, but I do need to pay more attention, that's for sure. Yesterday in my Walmart haul that I got that was delivered here, um, I got some shower curtains, yay! <laughs> but I didn't get shower rings to put them on. <laughs> but I wanted to show you this here beautiful right this is going to actually hang here in 
the bathroom. This was sent over by Nell, who's an awesome family friend, very close family friend. Um, and she sent a whole lot of artwork, but I like this. Look at that 3D. Isn't that pretty cool? That is going in Kyoto's bathroom. Ha, huh, so awesome. There's a few other things. I just wanted to show you this as well. You see this right here? Yes, this is so nice. And the coffee table here. The two end tables. That I got as a set. One thing I like about this, Dunkin Donuts coffee. I am actually gonna make coffee for the first time in the coffee pot. I cannot wait.